You're on Toon Tonight's Up TV. Bless up yourself. Out here to our reggae online. All right, greetings, welcome, Nice Up TV. I'm Hawkeye here in City of Bill, in the Ever Living Spirit Studio. Uh, I got the one like teacher with me, and uh, yeah, here for the Old Town Bashment. But uh, first up, yeah, I've been to New Zealand a couple of times. Few people know you there, but uh, for everyone else, just like to give a little introduction on yourself and uh, the Ever Living Spirit sound, all the team in that. Yeah man, greetings, no Zealand. Um, good to see you again, man. <laughs> Shit, it's been a long time. Yes, as I said, my name's Tijer. I'm one of uh, founder, one of the founders of Ever Living Spirit Zone. Um, yeah, we started about 11, 12 years ago with playing reggae music. Yeah, and. Um, Right now we are eight um, sound man in a sound system, about four selectors, one MC, and crew, yeah, and we're still ready, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, uh, how did Ever Living Spirit start, and um, when did uh, when did you all start getting serious about like uh, cutting dub plates and working with big artists and that kind of thing? Yeah, that's actually quite hard to say. Um, as I said, we started about 11, 12 years ago as a reggae DJ crew. Um, it was kind of s difficult in Switzerland to start as a DJ reggae sound system, reggae crew, um, because the scene wasn't that big. Um, there were just a, a few sounds around and it was quite heavy to, to get massive. Yeah, and um, I don't know, about three years later, we started cutting top plates in different um, studios around Beale. Um, I guess the first one was a Pinchers, um, yeah, 2005 or something like that. And uh, yeah, it, it goes on and on. <laughs> Yeah, man, it goes on and on. So long time you've been in the sound business. Uh, how do you keep up the motivation for yourself and the whole crew just to keep on pushing this music? Uh, I know you put on a lot of shows and bring artists from Jamaica and Europe all over. You know, how, how do you uh, yeah keep the motivation up with this kind of thing? Yeah, it's reggae music, man. I don't know, you live it. You feel it, you get it every day, they make some new music and that's quite the part um, of motivation, the, f the first part of motivation and and uh, yeah the other thing is of course the, the people who listen to reggae music, listen to the music that we play, that we bring to Beale and um, yeah, we get the support from the people and, and we try to support all reggae fans from Beale. So I guess this is the motivation and the power we, we, we get out of it, yeah. Yeah, so here in Beale, uh, you got a good local scene, um, a lot of sounds and that. Uh, yeah, I'd just like to talk about the local scene here and then maybe in comparison to uh, Germany or France where things are a bit bigger on, on the sound level. Yeah, the first thing I have to say, Biel is definitely the capital of reggae music in Switzerland. Like we run about 12 sound systems here, um, youths and, and, and elderly. Like um, yeah, reggae music in Biel runs for about 20 years. So that makes it strong and, and um, if you compare it to Paris or, or um, Berlin or um, all big cities around us um, it's quite similar they had they have more um, massive more crown uh, we just uh, a small populated town like about 50,000 people or something like that and um, we still get the people yeah they l love reggae music like they love reggae music in France so um, that's not dif different. The difference is 
like we're smaller um, and it takes uh, sometimes more energy um, for us uh, I mean promotion and 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 special um, the joys of some artists um, to bring the people in into the venue and 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 party at our party yeah I can definitely appreciate that coming from a small country myself but uh, Sizzler he's your artist man you got enough dub plates from him. how many <laughs> I don't know about twenty or something. Like that. Yeah, it's definitely my artist. I grew up with Sizzla, and he was one of the first artists I tried to cut on top plate. I love Sizzla, man. Sizzla, my brethren, you know. Yeah, man. Long time Sizzla fan myself. Uh, what kind of art, like when you're voicing your dub plates, what kind of artists you look for, and like um, what kind of style you like your dub plates to be cut in? Yeah, that's difficult. Um, as a reggae collector, like I have to collect for sure roots music, and it's difficult. Yeah, from time, from year to year, and time to time, it's more difficult to collect all those roots artists who are big and 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 artists you know from long time and tunes you know from long time even if you cut them now and you know the tunes are written maybe 25 30 years ago but i'm still a hunter um of music like this but um yeah new artists as well like chronix and and kabaka and, and and artists like this who who actually write the scene right now and 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 move the scene forward right now that's um yeah it's good to voice artists like that as well. Um, I, as a Rastaman, love to cut Rastaman. Yeah, looking forward to your selections at the Old Town Bashment this weekend. Um, would you like to tell the people a little bit of uh, the history of the Old Town and um, yeah, how long you've been running your stage there and who's playing this weekend and that kind of thing? Yeah, man. Um, we play um, reggae music at All Tone Bash about eight or nine years, nine years about. Um, we started small and now we're big. We, we got a big stage, 12 meters of bar and about 150, 200 people um, in the crowd. And um, yeah, I, I love the vibe there. It's a street carnival, a street fest party and and I love the vibe there. It's different to a dance hall. Um, there are some people who are just passing through, or some people who are really into the reggae, reggae music industry, or some people they not even know reggae and they stand in front of the big speakers we have and and just listen to music they they don't know. And that's the kind of party I love. That's the yeah. It's different to dance hall, and. Um, Many sounds gonna be on the stage this year. We're gonna have um, Hawkeye from the Nice Up crew, of course. Um, Big Mama Sound gonna play a female sound station out of Germany, Mannheim. Um, Roadblock Sound gonna play on this uh, stage on Saturday as well. On Friday we have um, Lion Power Sound System, local sound crew, um, Big One Aim Sound from this area here, playing yeah, 15 years reggae music in Beale. Um, we're gonna have uh, TJD straight from Jamaica, so um, mixed up lineup, and I'm um, looking forward for this weekend, yeah man. Yeah, as am I, it's gonna be a nice, nice vibe, nice dance. Uh, any last words for the people of Bill, New Zealand and uh, worldwide? Yeah man, keep reggae music in my heart, you know. New Zealand, I know you from long time, it's good to talk to you, yeah, through this camera thing, you know. Good things. Yeah man, New Zealand, looking forward to see you again. Yeah, bless up, teacher, ever living spirit sound, Bill, Switzerland, nice up crew, TV, peace. You've been watching Nice Up TV. Rewind and come again.